This morning in the Roadshow Kitchen, the Hungry Goats Kitchen is taking over. Chef Trevor is here. And man, if you love pasta, any combination of these items, you're going to love today's recipe. It's a broccoli alfredo in a chicken parm bowl. That sounds awesome. It, it how, is. How, how do you do it? Um, I'm not <laughs> going to, it's yeah, secrets. I'm not going to divulge everything. It's, uh, okay. I guess you could say it involves a frozen cast iron mold. We'll say that. Okay. Yeah. We'll leave it at that. <laughs> uh, but it sounds delicious. You're also our roadie deal of the day. You've yep. done it before. It's just $25, guys, for a $50 voucher. They've done it before because they keep selling out. So if you want it, they're already available at roadiedeals.com. So check that out. And also check out this recipe. What do we need to make this concoction? Uh, well, as, a, as we're talking about, we're doing the uh, broccoli alfredo. Mm -hmm. um, so we've... Uh, basically, there's garlic, uh, butter, a, a cheese blend, which is um, a mozzarella and provolone and mm. cheddar blend. Yum. Um, sh uh, grated Parmesan cheese, uh, heavy cream, mm -hmm. and the broccoli, of course. That would be like the, the star. <laughs> and I noticed, too, with the pasta, pre-cook that? Yes. Okay. Um, yeah, because we, what we'll do is we'll, we'll heat the pasta back up in the sauce. Okay. And then we'll put that in the bowl top it with cheese and oh, bake it yum. and finish it that way, yeah. That bowl is very rare, you were telling me. Yeah, I mean, we did some research, and as far as we can tell, uh, we haven't found anybody else in the country that's doing this. Ha-ha! So. so you want something cool, you're definitely going to want to head to their place and even head to our website so you can learn how to make this throughout the morning. And I will say one thing, not available on Fridays. Uh, because we do okay. you know, Fish Friday and, and that sort of thing, uh, so we can't really uh, take up too much of the fry later space for well, that. So. But that's okay yeah. because we have a long weekend ahead, right. so we can come in any other day exactly. and enjoy something like this. Exactly. We will get this uh, going in just a bit. Stick around. Now we're going to go back into the kitchen. Audrey, day. how's it going? Wow. We're talking dress codes in here in the kitchen. <laughs> we're, 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 we're thinking back, but I'm back with Chef Trevor from the Hungry Goats Kitchen. Don't forget, it's the roadie deal of the day. And we are now in the process of putting everything together. Yeah, yeah, uh, pretty much. We're going to get our Alfredo sauce together. Okay. Uh, just get, uh, I just got the pan on the, on the stove. I got it warming up. Love um, this. Essentially, it's a very, very simple recipe. Uh, we just start by melting some butter in our pan. Okay. Um, oh, I love, I love right. butter melting in a pan. And don't forget too, today we're making the broccoli alfredo on a chicken parm bowl, chicken right? chicken parm bowl. That's yeah. amazing. Right. Looks so delicious. So my favorite is alfredo. Yes. That's my favorite sauce with nice. pasta. So this is, this is a big treat for me today. Yeah, and then we're just going to start getting the, the garlic browning a little bit. Okay. And as that, as that starts to caramelize, the natural, you know, the, the sugars come out, it starts to get a little sweeter. Uh, so, you know how like uh, raw garlic has a, sort of a bite to yes. it? Yes, yeah. yeah. well this smooths it right out and makes it really nice. Oh wow, that's great. And um, then you just keep, what, so you slow, oh, then you add yeah, the broccoli. Yeah, we add the broccoli. I didn't know it's, that's it's a, Yeah, it's like fresh broccoli. So, cook that with the garlic. Um, we get a little caramelization on the gar on the broccoli as well. Same thing. See, the uh, natural sugars inside the broccoli will come out, and it'll just make it a little bit sweeter. Uh, also, at the same time, oh, I like that sound the sizzle. At the same time, you're pretty much cooking the broccoli. I mean, right? Because you know, um, and this way, also, you can kind of. Uh, you know, it's not going to be mush. Right, because you, you don't know. want it all mushy. You right. want to have that good bite with the broccoli, too, as exactly. you're eating. So then you just brown this up. Brown this and up And what's the next bit? thing we add next in? Next step is just heavy cream. Oh, the heavy cream right. goes in. Oh, you're speaking my language. Heavy cream, cheese. This looks like butter. Oh my goodness, looks so good. So we're gonna keep cooking right on here in the kitchen. And don't forget, we're gonna do another segment. We're gonna put everything together. So Chef Trevor, thank you so much. Keep coming on back and tuning back in because this is gonna be delicious it will be. when thank we you. finish. All right, back to you. Last time in the Roadshow Kitchen, we hope you're hungry because the Hungry Goats Kitchen is here. And Chef Trevor is whipping up a storm, making a delicious pasta dish. Audrey, we were talking about this before, man. If you love any sort of chicken parm, broccoli alfredo, yes. well, we're combining the it. two. We're putting the broccoli alfredo into a chicken parm bowl. Only one in the country. It's Can't get it anywhere the else. best yeah. idea on the planet. <laughs> it's like a genius, genius right. idea. Eat your meal and then eat the bowl. Yes. Exactly. Sounds good to me. It's like, it's like it doesn't a, get any better a, than an that. An updated version of a taco salad. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> right? That's what I was thinking when, when I saw yeah. this. I was thinking of the bowl that you mm. eat, eat the mm -hmm. whole Well, yeah, whole we meal. actually do that in the restaurant as well. We'll make like a Caesar salad, you oh, know, wow. fresh tossed Caesar salad. And we'll put you just it don't want to wash any dishes, do you? No, no. Hey, everyone, here's your meal and eat the plate. That's the secret. I should do this at home with everything. Right. So you have. Have a, a great 
uh, mix a little medley here in the pan it looks creamy it looks delicious yeah once the uh, the heavy cream reduces a little bit mm -hmm. then we add in our cheese blends and okay. then we let that cook down uh, we bring the we put the pasta in as you may mention before the cooked pasta mm -hmm. because all you're really doing is just sort of heating it up back up in the sauce. Hey, that's, that's a great idea. I never do that. You that's know? really yeah. smart. Oh, Good tips someone. for um, parents at home, especially when you're heading back to school. Make a big batch of pasta yeah. and then just spread it just, out throughout the week. Right. Maybe you pair it with Alfredo. It, chill it down and you can put mix it with any, any mm -hmm. sauce that you decide to choose from. Yeah. Uh, so once we get that just kind of mixed in. And, and you can see those strings so of good. cheese Oh my goodness, pulling. look at that. Yeah. That looks awesome. So is this a popular, so a is this yeah. one of your most popular dishes? Uh, this is actually re relatively new. Oh, it's just wow. something, yeah, it's okay. something that, that we've been working on the past few months. So this um, is your new most popular yeah, dish that's going to explode. Yeah, and, and also, as I said before, not on a Friday, because we'll do fish right. and chips mm -hmm. and stuff on a Friday. Right, and, right. Well, that'll keep you yeah. busy enough. Yeah, and yeah. that's a nice treat, we too. keep up. Look at that so going we'll right in. throw this in. Oh, a nice, a hearty, you know, this is, I'm thinking, too, in the winter. This is going to be so delicious, right? Or for a Go in on a cold night. Yes. See, we're, we're enticing. Yeah, up, we're like right? a nice, yeah. warm, cozy meal. And we're, I think we're just hungry. <laughs> yeah. Not finished the yet. Snowfall. Though. I know it's not done yet. No, huh? we're not finished yet. We've got to add some more cheese on top. Oh, and my that goodness. was a blend, you said, this right? This is a blend, yeah. It's uh, mozzarella mm -hmm. and cheddar and provolone. All Yum. like mild versions of them, mm -hmm. so not like the sharp. And then we'll put the grated Look Parmesan cheese on top. So if you are a cheese lover, oh, this is going to be is, your go-to dish. Is, this yeah, is really exactly. it. Um, Just like I this, have, I want to eat it. I've yeah. seen, I've seen people tackle these and themselves, but it's uh, yeah, they. Uh, and what do they do? They shareable. cut it up, or it do, you, do you pick shareable. it up? And, and, and you have you ever seen anybody just pick it up? Like oh, I wanted. I would love to see that. That'd right? be so yeah. great. Yeah. <laughs> pick it up like a big Why sandwich. Why not? Yeah. Right. Boom. Uh, so from nah, here, most people then what just, happens? Most people just uh, uh, use fork and knife. Okay. Uh, yeah. From here, we'll just throw it. We'll throw it in the oven. Okay. Oh, want me to pull this down? Yeah, if you want this is one thing I can do in the kitchen. Teamwork. You know. Oh, look at that. And then... How long do you suggest that those go for? Um, you're really only looking to try and get the cheese melted in a little golden brown. Now, okay. Right? That's all. Um, I did have one that we put in earlier. It didn't quite get golden brown, brown yet. yet. Well, why don't you let, it, it, let it go? Delicious. We'll let it keep going mm -hmm. for another couple of minutes. And while we're at it, we want to remind you about our roadie deal of yeah. the day. It's $25 for a $50 gift certificate over to Hungry Goat's Kitchen. Like you said, it's an opportunity to get food that you're never going to have elsewhere. Right, that right. That parm bowl, anything else? Um, you mentioned the fact that even our furry friends can kind of yeah, get involved, yeah, that's true. right? Yeah, yeah, we have a, a, a patio out uh -huh. front uh, where we set up picnic tables and, you know, umbrellas and stuff like that. And it's completely dog friendly. So if anybody so wants great. to come oh, that's by. Wonderful. And where are you yeah. located again? Just we're we're on again. Central Ave in Pawtucket. Okay. Um, yeah. It's and an easy you have location. restaurant week coming up. Yep. We had the folks from Pawtucket in the other day. That's right. That's right. And uh, actually, just recently, like uh, um, the the two papers in Pawtucket, the Call and the Times, they had their mm -hmm. best of. Uh, you know, um, I guess where you know people vote in or people write in oh, uh, online. We were made. We've made mention in like six categories. That's amazing. That's awesome, yeah. Yeah. That's amazing. You must be so proud. Oh, it's it's yeah that and that's going to hit the papers today apparently. Like good. That's, today. that's yeah, awesome. We'll look forward and to with seeing these new that. dishes, this creativity, mm -hmm. everything. Mm -hmm. That's unbelievable. Yeah, I, I can't that. wait till that golden brown color gets Please, on the cheese. Maybe tie, just tie my another, hands up and maybe let me just go in another right. minute. Yum. Okay, well, uh, you'll see the finished shot to close our show. Yes. Chef, thank you so much for sharing that with us. Thank you.